also the greatest thing at Crema this year. Make sure you speak loud so the mic gets you. Speaking loud. I'm sorry. <laughs> Wait, I need to make sure that my teeth aren't ready. Yeah. Is this recording? So. Are my glasses reflecting? Three questions. Question number one. One. Can't read it, hold on. What is the greatest thing that happened at Crema this year? I'm gonna take a little bit of time on this. Okay. Um. Scotty. Halloween with eyeliner on his eyes. Cool. Greatest thing. Just the whole string endeavor. And I could just, I just couldn't take him seriously. I didn't know how to talk to him. They hired me. I was hired here. I got hired! Woo! Crema has flourished this year, just like my hair has. No, um... I'm pretty fired up about the guys that we have working on our mobile team right now. I've learned how to win. But more importantly, I've learned how to lose. Wow. You've had a really, really good year. I don't really know. Uh, um, the greatest thing, man, has been Tiller. For me, it has been working on the Tiller project. We've worked with a lot of great clients. Pretty much anybody right now that's a developer is able to program on a mobile side, and it's awesome. I really want to keep these clients. I need Ross, I need Ross. Easily, hands down, the best thing that happened at Crem this year. I don't know what Ross is doing right now. Okay. Oh my goodness, that's the greatest thing that happened this year. The Thanksgiving video with Robin Ross. The greatest thing that happened this year was Ross and I made that that cooking video, and I've never been the same since. And you want to get it all over your friend's hands. Oh, good to know. I can't go on. Secondly, I think Rob launching water balloons. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Maybe the second greatest thing, if not the greatest thing. Uh, this holiday party is, uh... Well, the greatest thing that happened at Crema this year is the holiday party that's happening outside the door right now. Probably the greatest. Greatest thing that ever happened this year. It's just too much. It was so good. This Christmas party's pretty great. Single greatest thing this year. You know what? Man, it took three tries, but we got a really cool website. It was so good. It is the people. <sighs> oh, well, they get robbed. What do you think? this person wants for Christmas this year. Let's see what name I draw. Scotty. Matt, what do you want? Scotty, I know what he wants for Christmas this year. It's this uh, really fancy coffee roaster. I think he already has it on pre-order as of like four or six months ago. A lush head of hair. Mitchell. Mitch. Maybe a wig. I got Neil. Well, he already has an elf suit, so. I got Alex. I think Mitch could probably could probably graduate to a Santa costume this year. Neil probably wants some hair products. Alex probably wants Haley. Every single flavor of vaping juice you can ever get. That's that's what it is. What do I think this person wants for Christmas this year? Oh boy. Strawberry kiwi. Forget the elf. A new baby? Pink lemonade, whatever. It's uh, a good question. I got Laura. I drew my own name. Not that your current baby is not okay. If, if you had a drone. Here. Merry Christmas. I think Laura wants everybody to put their dishes into the dishwasher. Airdrop some vape juice into his thing while he does it. I think he'd be very happy and That would be the greatest present for Alex Benson. Maybe you know something that's striped Eric wants a oh, Dropped it Something that could fit in a Wes Anderson film a little bit better. I think I'm pretty correct about that Lock trailer full of camera 
favorite gear? I drew Alexa out of the hole. Okay, it says Alexa. I drew Chris. It's diamond encrusted. What does Paul want for Christmas this year? It's Dan. He seems like a guy that might read and might like to read. Top of the line. So what would she want for Christmas? I know she's been doing a lot of house projects lately. Luke. My person is Luke. I think Paul just wants a healthy family. You know this like uh, grass hut? Seems like a book guy. Dan is a, uh, he's a, uh, what's the, what's the brand? I like Dan. Can you see that? I probably want a case of beer. They're like, they've got like grass on the roof. GoPro. I bet Luke wants a GoPro drone that doesn't blow up or just drop out of the air. Well, I know what he wants for Christmas this year because he told me. Okay, uh, Ross. I would buy Michael a Tesla. Actually going back to Chris's gift, an Xbox One or whatever the new thing is. Sorry, buddy, that sucks. We were so excited about that drone. I think she would want a Tahiti beach vacation for Christmas. <laughs> you got the Chevy Volt. That's what he wants, because he told me. He told me that's what he wants. Probably a new synthesizer. Let's get Chris some armor off for his new car. Probably a new van. I know he's been through a couple different vans. Some armor off. And let's go with some tire shine. I would get Chris for, for, for Christmas. Lastly, what type of project or technology do you want to work on next year? Hardware? A piece of hardware, like simple hardware, nothing like circuitry. But mostly just want to dance. Wearable or VR experience? VR. VR. I'm really hoping we get to work on some VR projects next year. Augmented reality. Let's say I want to work on some VR and some wearable stuff. So maybe VR is where we start? I promise you, George, I'm going to start on the Christmas break working back on that mower app. A React Native. I want to give it a go. Could we be a React Native only shop? Well, I would love to dive into React Native. QuickBooks? I want to do a keystone for the API. GraphQL. Maybe something with GraphQL. Just something that is a little more meta. Um, something like that. What does that even mean? 